Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video will be on this soft a cut crease look that I've created with the Wonderful Palette by Urban Decay, um, which is a collaboration with Gwen Stefani. If you guys haven't heard, this palette is going on sale because it's a limited edition, so that means it's only available for a certain amount of time. I bought this palette last year and I love it. I've been using it ever since. So if you're interested in seeing how I created this look, then keep on watching. Okay guys, are you ready for this tutorial? We're gonna go ahead and grab our palettes. Um, they're on sale at Ulta for $39 and today I'm gonna create a soft cut crease for you um, using some of these colors. Let me see get this in frame we are going to be using uh, this one this one is a transition and then I can't make up my mind on these um, I don't know which one I'm gonna be using for the base yet but I know for sure this one's for the transition and then this one right on top and then um, that will be in the crease so let's go ahead and get started Okay, I'm going to go ahead and apply Urban Decay's um, Primer Potion all over my um, eyelid. Okay, so next I'm going to go ahead and use um, this flat brush. It's the M33 by Morphe. I'm going to go ahead and lay down the base. And for the base, I'm just going to go ahead and use... Um, I'm gonna go ahead and use Stark, which is this color in the center right here. And I'm just gonna put that all over my lid. And this is gonna be a really simple look. It's gonna be easy. Everyone's gonna be able to do this, even me. <laughs> okay. So there's the base. I'm gonna go ahead and um, grab me a fluffy brush and I'm gonna go ahead and um, use Anaheim which is this color right here for the transition it's like a light um, very 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 light brown and I'm gonna put it just right above my crease and um, you just want to put it above and don't worry about it being perfect you just want to lay it right above because we're gonna go ahead and lay more colors on top of it, like two more. Okay, so that's it. So, so far we've used um, Stark for the lid and we've used Anaheim for the crease. Let's go ahead and move on to the next color, which is gonna be um, Zone. It's this one right here. And I'm gonna use the same brush. I'm just gonna do the same thing. This one's a little darker than Anaheim, so. Make sure that it's right above your crease. And this is how I blend my eyeshadow. I just go back and forth, back and forth. Make sure you save this brush. We're gonna go on um, with a crease brush because we're gonna go ahead and apply the darkest color now. So for the crease brush, I'm using Morphe's M169. And this is what it looks like. So we're gonna go in with my favorite color from the palette and that is punk, it's right here. And we're gonna go ahead and apply it strategically right in the crease because that's what's gonna make our cut crease. Ready, don't mess up. So I started right here from the center. I should probably zoom you guys in so you could see. So we're gonna go ahead and put it like just starting right here in the center and. That's all I'm doing, see? It's, okay. Now, um, I'm gonna do it to the other side so we can go ahead and start blending after this. Now we're gonna go back with our brush, the fluffy brush, and we're gonna go in with um, Zone again, which was the last um, color that we used in um, for over our transition. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab some of that. And that's gonna help us blend out this color that we applied in the crease. So you're just going back and forth, back and forth. And 
one you just want to get it to where it's just you don't see that line anymore like you don't want it to be harsh so you're just going back and forth back and forth and then you can close your eye if you want to and just make sure that it's blended okay and I'm pretty much done there gonna clean up this side I went a little too far and um, this is what it looks like so far I'm gonna go ahead and grab my flat brush again and I'm going to apply um, let's see I'm going to apply skimp which is this color right here I'm going to apply that only to my lid okay so I'm, it's just gonna go underneath the crease not above the crease because you don't want to ruin uh, the colors that we already placed there so just right underneath and there you go it just brings it out like just a tiny bit more and i'm just gonna put just a little bit on the top not too much there we go that is um that is it with the eyeshadow palette i'm gonna go ahead and apply my eyeliner i'm gonna do a cat eye and then i'm gonna finish my eyebrows and i'll i will be right back So I'm gonna go ahead and curl my eyelashes and I'm gonna go ahead and use um, Better Than Sex Mascara. I like to do my mascara first. I don't know about um, you guys, but I do the mascara first and then I do the eyeliner. I feel like um, since I have to use the eyelash curler, um, when I use the eyelash curler after my eyeliner, like I feel like some of it goes missing or it fades away. So, I do my eyelashes first. Um, okay guys, I totally forgot to apply the eyeshadow underneath. Um, I'm supposed to go in with the, sorry. I, I had to stop filming because my SIM card or my SD card, whatever, my memory card ran out of space. So I'm trying to get myself back together. So we're just going to do the same. I'm going to go in with zone right here, this color. And just uh, run it underneath my lid like this. And then we'll do it to both sides, of course. And then um, kind of like try to connect it to the top. Okay. Now I'm going to go in with the dark color that we did for our crease. And again, we're just going to run it over. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with a uh, regular eyeliner. I'm, I'm gonna use um, the NARS Larger Than Life uh, Longwear Eyeliner, and that's gonna go um, in my tight line. So I'm gonna tight line under here on the upper lid, and I'm, I'm gonna do it on the bottom as well. Now we're going to go in with the liquid eyeliner and I'm using uh, Revlon's um, Color Stay eyeliner and like the darkest black, blackest black. Okay, so to finish the look, I'm going to go in with these Demi Wispies by Ardell and that's going to finish the look. You can, And I'm using uh, the Kiss... Um, black glue or eyelash ad adhesive. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and apply a very light lip gloss. This is um, Anastasia Beverly Hills um, Vintage. And that's the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna zoom you guys in so you can see the finished look. This is what it looks like. A 
love it. Thank you again for coming by. I will see you guys in the next video. If you guys have any comments, don't forget to comment down below. Also, don't um, don't forget to check out my social media. I have Snapchat, and that's more of like a personal, like um, more and like behind the scenes, like what I do during the day um, with my kids. Um, I stay at home, and we do other things besides makeup and um, my Instagram is purely dedicated to my makeup so if you want to go check that out like some pictures I will link that down below see you guys in the next video bye